Hello, I am Dr. Girish Nelvigi. I am a urologist from Nelvigi Multi-Speciality Hospital, Belandur, Bangalore. Today, I want to speak on evaluation and treatment of advanced prostate cancer. When I am talking of advanced prostate cancer, I am referring here to that cancer which has spread to various parts of the body. Prostate cancer can commonly spread to the bones, lymph nodes, lungs and liver and then the brain. This is commonly called a stage 4 prostate cancer. The evaluation of such a cancer is by tests like MRI and PET CT scan. These tests can detect the foci of prostate cancer in various parts of the body. And once you see prostate cancer in various parts of the body, it comes under the category of advanced or metastatic cancer prostate. The treatment for such advanced prostate cancer is mainly palliative which means to say there is no cure, no matter what you do for advanced prostate cancer. We can only retard the growth of prostate cancer and also alleviate or reduce some of the symptoms of prostate cancer. What is the treatment for advanced prostate cancer? The mainstay of treatment is hormone therapy. However, hormone therapy is not the only treatment for advanced prostate cancer. It is often combined with radiation, chemotherapy and nowadays newest kid on the block is immunotherapy. So hormone therapy is important in the treatment of prostate cancer because our testosterone which is a hormone, sexual hormone in the males is a fuel for the growth of the prostate cancer. So this testosterone level can be decreased by two methods. One is by injections and second is by removing both the testicles by surgery. Once hormone therapy is given the growth of prostate cancer stops temporarily but it cannot be stopped permanently. Over a period of 18 to 24 months it starts growing again. That's the reason why hormone therapy is necessary but it is not enough. As I told you we combine chemotherapy, radiotherapy and immunotherapy in treatment of advanced prost prostate cancer. Side by side the patient will have symptoms like pain, anorexia, difficulty in passage of urine, bone uh, mineral loss, etc., which have to be treated appropriately by supportive measures.